I'm Lindsay with Endlessly Organic, and today we're gonna roast a butternut squash. Butternut squash is one of the few things that grows organically in Florida in the summer. Once you've cut your butternut squash in half, all you have to do is get in here with a spoon and scoop out the seeds. Now that we've cleaned our butternut squash and we've taken all the seeds out, what we can do is roast the seeds and roast the squash. Same process. All you have to do, a little bit of olive oil so on the butternut squash, a little bit of salt. Then just take a paper towel and then you can get it all beautifully coated. Once you've finished coating your squash, what you wanna do is put it face up on the pan. You're gonna put it at 425 for 25 minutes and then check it probably every five to 10 minutes until it's soft and then the top side is caramelized. Uh, for the seeds, what you wanna do, just mix them together with the oil and the salt and then just put them out on your tray. These won't take very long, so you just have to make sure that you watch them, but it could be as fast as maybe five or 10 minutes. So let's put our squash in the preheated oven. We can put our seeds in there too. Um, so we finished our seeds. They're a gorgeous golden brown color. This is a really easy way to add a gluten-free crunch to your salad or to your soups. Our butternut squash has been cooking for an hour, so let's see how it looks. Oh, so gorgeous and caramelized. So let's take it out. Oh, you've got to see this. I'm Lindsay with Endlessly Organic. Please visit us online at endlesslyorganic.com.